Tachyosaurus, but at the same time, I don't have to worry about getting stepped on by one. My favorite dinosaur is Trinosaurus Rex. They are interesting and they're big, so big. They're real neat and fascinating. They're big and scary. Stimulating that imagination is a young people's dig and campsite at Egg Mountain. It's an open-air workshop inspired by Jack Horner. We saw some children out there today, a very bright nine-year-old fellow. Tell us something about the camp. I mean, what is it exactly? Well, it's run as a field school. Uh, it's, it's a place where people can, interested people, can come out and really be part of the research, be part of what really goes on here. Since Jack Horner first discovered dinosaur eggs in America in 1978, hundreds of children of all ages have spent time on Egg Mountain. For Horner, it's the climax of a long career. What would you like to be remembered for? Probably the behavior. Um, it's been what I've been working on all this time. Behavior of the dinosaurs? Behavior of the dinosaurs, yes. This is what dinosaurs are good for education and learning about life and the history of life uh, so that we know what our world is about and what's going to happen to our world. Jack Horner and others revolutionized our idea of dinosaurs. Out went the idea that they were lumbering, slumbering giants. Now we know that they were among the most successful creatures that ever lived on this planet. But if that's the case, why did they die out? Well, some think it was a mass extinction. Others are not so sure. And did all the dinosaurs die out? Or perhaps did some survive in a different form? For some clues to the death of the dinosaurs, join me for our next episode.